What's happening, what's happening, what's happening? Of course you know it's your boy b Hot Radio Shout in as always. I got my podcast partner with me, OG Gangsta Wicked. Yes, a sir. ghetto mafia. I'm in the build. b Hot. What's man, happening? I, I've, been, I've been dying to get here. Talk to me. This necklace right here was handcrafted, right? Ooh. So the lady that made it for me, she was like, um, you know, you think b Hot would want, you know, a nice necklace with the with the bracelet to match? Yeah. And I said, uh, yeah. 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 <laughs> it's over. <laughs> in mine, I wasn't on the punchline. <laughs> that is the punchline. The punchline is around my neck. <laughs> I wasn't on the punchline. Oh, Praise man. Now, that was a good one, but I still don't like it, okay? <laughs> Let's just get down to business. We can hear playing around some of the damn chain. We got a Memphis 10 legend off in this thing, yeah, man. That's right, man. man. That's right. Frazier, yeah. boy, what's good well, with it, Pablo, boss? Man. Well, Papa ATL, y'all know what it is, man. man. Hey. Thank y'all for having me. As always, man. Appreciate yes, you coming through this yes, thing. Yes, sir, it's that's a man right, right there. See, a man give a, a strong handshake. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm tired of the yeah, little weak ass hand depth hand your head be giving back. <laughs> we be like, oh, I'm a little princess. <laughs> oh, weak ass head boy. No, sir. Yeah, man. Don't you better do come. Don't do exactly, the man. Uh, mean it when you dap me down. Say what you say. That's disrespect. Come on, man. I mean, Frazier. I mean, what the hell's going on, man? New music. I mean, what we doing for it out here? I'm just trying to stay afloat I hear all yeah. behind, man. You know how it go, man. I'm just trying to stay active, stay, stay, you know, strong in the game. Yeah. Stay letting these young youngins know that old he is still in this thing <laughs> and we still doing this and we still <laughs> just 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 making good music, man. Exactly, exactly. I mean, for those that don't know Frazier, I mean yeah. You came out with a hard ass click at the same time, man. Well, first of all, just when it comes to the music, can you speak to what was it that got Frazier Boy started in the game? Well, I got started in the, I actually, um, you, you know how sometimes they say it don't happen overnight? Mm -hmm. um, it, it, it's kind of did for me because my story is so unique from anybody else's. Mm -hmm. I started, um, I met Coops the nigga, rest in peace Coops the nigga. Yes, sir. Um, uh, I used to uh, kick it with his cousin Pam in the Greenbrier in mm -hmm. Fraser, yeah, yeah. Bay Area where I'm from, Memphis. Okay. Uh, that was her cousin, so I, I started, he started coming up there and we met. Yeah. So I and me and him ended up getting cool and acquainted. So I started going back and forth, taking them to the studio with Paul and Jay. Mm -hmm. So that's how I got cool with Paul and Jay. So yeah. I ended up being good friends with them, so I started being in the studio on a daily. That was mm. before I started doing music. Okay. So um, they used to do crowd chants from here and there, from yeah. time to time. You know, like to get booked with the crowd people with the hook to join in. And um, I used to get in, you know, I, while I was at the studio, I used to get in the crowd chants and help them, you know, fill out the... Hooks. The hooks. Yeah. I guess my voice stuck out. Yeah. And they probably saw something that I didn't even know I had in myself. They probably were like, man, he probably could do this on his own. So yeah. we, we might can, and man, uh, little Chad Murder, she spoke. That was the first thing uh, that, that my voice was heard on. My first time really rapping or laying, recording a verse. Yeah. So, you know, uh, Project Pat was in jail at the time, where it was in prison at the time, and the uh, count was kind of short. Yeah. You know, if everybody know every uh, album Hypnotize put out, we used to do a posse song. Facts. People used to go, go straight to the posse song, so we yeah, used to yeah. make sure we had to do a posse song. And at the time, it was maybe two people, three people, other <laughs> oh, than three six, <laughs> outside of the clique. So the posse song was kind of shout. Yeah. So they was joking like, Frazier, we might need to put you on the posse song, man. It ain't, you know, it ain't many people left. So I was like, man, you, I'm, they didn't know how serious I was waiting and how long have I been waiting on it to answer this. So I was like, man, trap me. Ooh. I said, trap me. Paul said, go on, write your eight. Wrote eight, laid that jump. Maybe two weeks later, uh, got a hypnotized mind contract and I never looked back. My uh, God. And that's how my story happened. That's crazy. So, and I just yeah. started getting more series and, and just kept writing and, and, and hey, it became a real craft for me. I mean, before going crazy in the studio, you was going crazy on the court though, man. man see how you know, see, you be doing. <laughs> <laughs> see, a lot of folks don't understand, man. My left hand is, man, man, that left Come hand, bro. I'm a lefty now too, but don't go there with they me. They don't be understanding, like, you know, I used to do this in the, in the, in the projects in the hood, man, I used to make thousands. What? We used to be on some, you know, like the, like they used to do on uh, New Jack City. Mm. Yeah, you know, on the court, uh, hustling and gambling. Mm -hmm. Man, I used to come. I was so my jumper was so pure. 
Mm. That the big dope boys used to come get me from the house and go against the other hoods and my we used to take it all. My God. I'm hooping now. Well, I ain't gonna say today. <laughs> <laughs> but that was my first passion. But for I'm you to say, go to college with it, though, man. Yeah, yeah, I played like two years at all. Uh, I mean, that's cold blooded. Shiv State, yup, yup, yup. So a lot of folks don't know that I, I used to do this for real. You I know, used to do this for real. Wick thought that he was a ball player. I yeah. was a ball player. Everybody, the twelfth man from everybody. Was, I started <laughs> oh, the water boy. I started. You and started grade. heading out Gatorade in the fourth grade. quarter. I was on varsity, yeah. so stop hating. Okay. I was on varsity. Uh-huh. That's about me. He okay. had like he one of the greatest ball players ever. I, I don't believe it. I sure am. I was Curry before Curry. Was Curry See, before Curry? Frazier said, "What position you play? You talking about Curry before Curry? What position I, I, would you I, play? I, I, Water I boy? A, I was I was a, 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 one and, a one and a two. Don't say wide receiver. <laughs> that, was, that's what, that was him. That's him right now. <laughs> He was tall. We now. never picked him. He was he was he was six five in the eighth grade. How do you now? Where he was in eighth grade, we never picked him. First of all, in Big Hill, I'm known as a legend. Okay. <laughs> With a last name like Hightower, when you hit that football <laughs> field or that basketball court, yeah. it went down every time, okay? Then yeah. he don't put a ball in my hand because it's either going in the hoop tell or over the goal clips. line. Tell him to show you some clips. Show me some clips. <laughs> the motherfuckers on Polaroid. This is back in the early 90s. Polaroid. <laughs> they didn't have clips then. It's on the Polaroid. They didn't you know. have clips then.